Angels hosting the A's. The A's are minus 110 on the money line. The Angels are minus 106. The over-under is 9.5 runs. The A's laying a run and a half on the run line are plus 150, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, it has to be by two runs or more. And the Angels getting a run and a half on the run line are minus 182, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. The weather is supposed to be 86 degrees with eight mile an hour winds blowing out and no rain. It looks like the A's changed the pitcher because it was supposed to be Stripling and it looks like it's going to be Spence instead. And if it is Stripling, he didn't, neither one of the pitchers pitched for Spence. He pitched three times against the Angels this year. Five and a third innings pitched, three strikeouts, 16 outs recorded, five hits, three walks, two earned runs, no home runs, 85 pitches. And then it was five and a third, five strikeouts, 16 outs recorded, six hits, one earned run, one walk, no home runs. And then five and a third innings pitched, six strikeouts, 16 outs, which seems to be the magic number, eight hits, one walk, six earned runs. And in those games, they won eight to two, they won seven to five, and then they lost seven to five in LA. So maybe that's why they went away from stripling and went with Spence. Head to head, they're five and five against each other. The home team is nine and one. The favorite is both seven and three on the money line and seven and three on the run line. The over is hit in their last three. There have been no one-run games in their last ten. The over is six and four, and the over nine is six and four. This is Rosenberg's first start of the season, and for Spence, we have to go and find him again. He's going on four days rest in his last ten starts. He's averaging five and a third innings pitched. 4.5 strikeouts, 16.7 outs, 6.1 hits, 1.5 walks, 3.2 runs, 3.1 of which are earned, 0.9 home runs, 91.6 pitches per game, and 16.9 pitches per inning. And I don't know why the home team dominates the way that they do when they play each other. The A's are 6-4 and four in their last 10, 2-2 two two in their last 4, 13 runs, 4 runs, 10 runs, 9 runs, 5 runs and a loss, Four runs and a win, eight runs and a win, one run and a loss. The over is seven and three in their last ten. The Angels are seven and three in their last ten. They're on a four-game winning streak. The over/under is five and five. Thirteen runs, four runs, six runs, three runs, eight runs and a win, three runs and a win, five runs and a win, two runs and a win. I'm going with the home underdog here for whatever the reason is. When they play each other, the home team just wins. Angels with the money line. Angels getting the runs, and I'm going to go over. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.